No. I don't think we can do ah, that's really creepy. Okay. I think we're actually supposed to not let that happen. Okay. How are we supposed to stop it? No idea. Everybody. Hello, everybody. I'm Nubicus Maximus, and I'm Cryptic Enigma. And I'm leaving this warning up because I figure if you are gonna, if anything is going to cause a seizure or anything like that, you probably need to know about it. We are playing a game called Cursed Root, and this is the first thing that pops up. And I haven't seen this in any of the video games since we've been doing this. Um, it's supposed to be a scary game, which is why I have my safety blanket and my safety dragon. Yeah, it's 9 o'clock at night. We're both falling asleep. She's like, we need to play a horror game. <laughs> why? Because I want to scare you. Scare you. <laughs> so, scare you. Yeah, she's trying to make it so I can't sleep. No, nah, if I was doing that, I'd have you do another one of those games that was on there. <laughs> that was super, super, super scary. That I know is super scary. This, this one's one, supposed to be scary, too. Yeah, this one's supposed to be really scary. Now, we did accidentally start a new game just trying to get everything, everything to work, so I'm going to start a new game. game. Race current autosaver, you sure? Yes. This one, I think, was... That's added to 14 days ago. Yeah, this one's pretty new. Antillery! It all started with that phone call. Uh oh. It's always a good way to start games like this. Don't skip. Okay. Okay, it yeah. was my aunt whom I hadn't spoken to in a long time. She called bearing bad news about my uncle. Aww. You've been playing a lot of really depressing games today. He had passed away. She sounded odd. I thought it perhaps was because she was crying. At the time, I could never have imagined the real reason why. However, I was about to find out. Was she dead, too? Why were you crying? <laughs> but it is sad. It is sad. I do have my safety dragon, too. My aunt and uncle had always been like the father and mother I had never had. They took me in and treated me like a son after the mysterious disappearance of my parents. Fifteen years ago, I had moved from their home to the U.S. to seek my fortune there, and due to huge distance between us, we had seldom seen a... each other. other. It was a long journey, but I decided to catch the first train. This time, must have been chasing my fortunes, and we missed it. So go Sorry. back and read it. <laughs> I tried. Please back to see them. I took the first plane back home and after a long flight I had stepped back onto home soil. I felt bizarre being back after such a long time. Their home was on the outskirts of Corkill, so I took a taxi. I have no idea where that is. The roads narrowed as I neared the house, but that wasn't all. I sensed that something was wrong. The very sight of the house gave me shivers. I almost didn't recognize it. So much had changed since I left. Stepping out of the car, a chill went down my spine. I felt that something had truly gone wrong inside the house. Uh -oh. However, nothing could have prepared me for the horrors I was about to face. And nothing has prepared me, so I'm going to run away and hide. <laughs> unlocked, Auntie should really be more careful. Uh oh. The trip was exhausting. I forgot how far their house was from town. You know that feather looks like a hand behind her? It does, kind of up here. Ugh. Dot, dot, dot. What happened to the house? This place is in ruins. I should look for Auntie. I saw the lights on. The lights were on in the dining room. Okay, dining room door. Oh yeah, she looks like a corpse. Auntie, how are you? I came as quickly as I could. I still can't believe that uncle's gone. My dear, you've come. 
What's happened is a tragedy, but I'm so glad to see you in these challenging times. But please, first, take a seat and have a cup of tea. You must be exhausted from your journey. Thank you, Auntie. A cup of tea would be lovely. They've got to be British. <laughs> Something's not right. I feel dizzy. That's always a good sign. Your auntie drugged you? I feel like, like... Hmm, feel like what? Oh. <laughs> she lost her marbles. Auntie killed uncle, I think. My head hurts. What just happened? Where am I? This looks like auntie's bedroom. There's a joke in here that I'm just not going to go after. <laughs> I must have fallen asleep, but how did I get here? I better take a look around. Yeah, your auntie dragged you up there. After drugging you. Mirror. Oh, mirror. That, what could go wrong? An old mirror. Yes, it is. Thank you. Drawers. Just some old clothes in here. I can see what's holding the drawer. Maybe I can push it with something thin enough. A book. Or a file folder, excuse me. There's a file folder? Mm -hmm. Ooh, what's this? Most of the pages in the journal have been torn. One of the few remaining pages seems of interest. 19th of March, 2015. I fear that my attempt to seal the portal has made the situation worse. Always a great start. <laughs> But there is no turning back now. The entities now have an easy way to enter the human realm. And I've seen her already able to take physical form. Even if only for a short time. Natural light and fire seem to weaken them somewhat. But my last candle is running out and it's only 3 a.m. I fear I won't. The rest of the page has been torn. Hmm. Dun, dun, dun. Auntie ain't who she thinks she is. Oh, I'm sure she's fine. That's my uncle's handwriting. He must have been delirious during the final days. <laughs> I better look for Auntie. She might be able to explain what this is all about. The chest won't open. This bed has definitely seen better days. It's dark now. I must have been asleep for a few hours. Door. Oh, my head. Yes, well, that's what happens when your auntie slips you a Mickey. <laughs> that sound, it felt like my head was about to explode. That'd be an interesting way to end the game. <coughs> sound? Yeah, it has pulse rate. A decorative bowl. I can see my reflection in this dusty mirror. I look very tired. The dim light makes the second floor corridor barely visible. Go left, go right, go west. Stairs. Let's go to the door. And yeah, should have seen that coming. I just noticed that the icon in the upper left hand corner is an old style floppy disk as the save marker. It's a portrait of my grandma. I never had the chance to meet her. Uh oh. Buckets of Sadness, 1817 by Sigmund Punch. This light's flickering is driving me nuts. The wires are exposed. Wires! Door! Nothing interesting here. Can't open it. The handle is missing. Oh, one of those. Mm hmm. Alright, let's go right. Go right. If you run into Auntie, I'm gonna be like. Wooden box. It's locked, but it seems quite fragile. We'll break the dang thing. What's this? Looks like an iPad or something. My not so smartphone, it's not getting any signal. Damn Corkill. Nice. <laughs> There's nothing in the drawers. This door is locked. It's locked. Okay, I have a feeling we have to go downstairs. Which actually would be hard because if you didn't see that this was a stair just by goofing off, you wouldn't have really noticed it. Not again. Hey, you just walked down a flight of stairs in the migraine, dude. What'd you expect? Ooh, creepy. 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 That better Ooh. be Auntie. Damn, the lights in this house. Oh, jeez. <laughs> My goodness. It's a ghost. Seriously. 
Where that go? feather hand going. <laughs> She's talking about this up here. It looks like a hand. Mm -hmm. Closet door. Wooden boards are blocking the door. Somebody really wanted to keep people out or in. Matchbox. There's only one match left. Oh, well, that's good. Mm hmm. Coat hanger. Considering she ran out of candles. Didn't she have candles he ran in out the... Of, he ran out of candles. Didn't they have candles in the um, dining room, though? Uh, maybe. Because if they did, then they... Because they wouldn't like candlelight. So if she was one of those things, she wouldn't like it. Can't start a fire with just a match. Well, how about you burn the iPad? Dining room? There are candles in here. Hillary, what happened? She's not breathing. I'm calling an ambulance. No signal. <laughs> There's no signal here. Dude, she's been dead for a while. See? Oh. I don't think we can do ah, that's really creepy. Okay. I think we're actually supposed to not let that happen. Okay. How are we supposed to stop it? No idea. Uh -oh. Continue. Hall. Oh. Maybe not going to the dining room yet? Well, we gotta find her, so let's see if we can stop it. Well, let's see if we can stop it. Grab the candles. They're not supposed to light candles. Well, that was different. I wonder if I can just run away. Nope, I can't. You can't hold her. Mm. Well, I couldn't get it in time or I couldn't grab it. Mm. <sighs> can try one more time. See because it can... said that they didn't like natural lighting. I know. I remember. Which makes it kind of weird that she's sitting right by it. Okay, so one thing I did notice is I need to grab the matches first. So I missed that the first time. And now I went into another room. So let's just look here. Newspaper. It's an old newspaper from a couple years ago. I've put it in my file folder. Now let's look at the file folder. May f 14th May 2013 missing persons parents distraught over daughter disappearance police are actively searching for Yolanda who was reported missing two days ago by her parents she was last seen in Cork Hill Central Park with the family dog she would never have run away I'm sure something dreadful has happened to her her father was reported as saying in response to questioning the police have so far not uncovered any evidence to suggest that the girl in question was abducted five other cases in a similar nature have been reported in to the police in the last 12 months that's a trend you focus on those also are you sure her name wasn't saffron i am so confused yolanda saffron yosaf bridge firefly oh. old radio haven't seen one of these in a while plant it's so withered there's a withered plant in the vase a label beside it reads didn't know such a plant existed. Tibetan vampiric mandrake. That ain't a bad side. No, wait. I need to go back. I need to go back. Bookcase. All kinds of subjects are in the bookcase. Uncle John really loved reading. You can't pull off the mandrake? That would be wonderful. No. Nope. Bookcase door. Somebody's holding the door, but I don't see any keyholes. Metal bars are installed in front of the window? When did they become so paranoid? Get a poker. Fireplace tools? Yes, Please I know. take one. I want one. Decorative plate. I think it's made of porcelain. Piano. I remember she was very fond of it and I would never have let me play it. Oh well, now I know how to drive her nuts. Grandpa's clock, really, it was my grandfather's clock. Womp womp. Nope, behind this cushion in the chair. 
I keep trying to read the graphic. This is an old. This is the old crumpled piece of paper that I found under the cushion of the living room chair. It seems to be sort of list, and the handwriting reminds me of uncle's. Could it have some other hidden meaning? After dusk and before dawn, painter of portrait of Count Amadeus the Third of Corkill in life history. R one B four. Ribs. <laughs> All right, so the only place I really have left, and it's good that it's saved, is I've got to go into the dining there room. There isn't a way on the other side. No. Pick this up. See if you can run. And now, oh sh! Nikes. Where the heck am I supposed to go? No idea, cause I don't think there's a door. I am dead, again. Hmm. All right, so let's try continuing again. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I'm out of areas to explore, aren't I? Turn around. Oh, really? Too tired now. I'll unpack it later. By Philip Van Damme. An old umbrella stand. That's an old dirty mirror. I just reached. Why should I leave already? I don't believe me. You're going to want to. Hmm. Well. I wonder if you can. And what? Well, I wonder if you'll have time to. See what we have in here. Oh. Never know when I'll need a bottle of glue. Did I smash it with my iPad? What is this? It's for your inventory being too big. And so nothing is here, so once again, just gonna look around for a minute. So, well, the coat hanger seems very sturdy. Would it is there, pick can it you um, go past the coat hanger? No, it just, just gets to turn around, which again, we're back where we were a minute ago. Mm -hmm. right, so let's see if we can. Well, maybe you can do it fast enough where it does, you can leave. Maybe. Well, we will see. I didn't drink this earlier. Or did I drink There's this? There's maggots on it. Oh, you're right, there are maggots on it. I'm not gonna click anti Hillary just yet. Try the door. That's where we came. I don't see anything to do other than. I would, especially given everything else I've seen here. Mm -hmm. I wonder if I can beat her with the radio. No. Get out. Thank and then you. turn around real quick. Oh, I got the coat hanger. Alright, excellent. Now can you leave? I, I don't know. No, this can't be real. That can't be my aunt. Oh, I used it to brace the door. Yeah. Okay, good. I don't know what the hell is going on here, but I'm not staying here another minute. You had a chance to leave. Damn, it won't budge. I need to look for another way out of here. Door is locked. Maybe I pack something that might help. I don't know. Do you have a shotgun? Let's see. Hey, it's my lucky sock. <laughs> hey, and 
now? Emergency sewing kit. I forgot I had this in my luggage. Better question, why? Huh. Okay. Can't clean them? Alright. Why? Well, let's check to see if there's a window that we can escape out of. Even if I break the glass, there are still those metal bars blocking the Oh, and then in the living room there's bars, too. Now is there bars up in the second story? Um... Bedroom. Because I know there are us in the first story. There was a crumpled note in the coat. Twenty fifth of February two thousand eleven. Today Hugo managed to figure out the combination to unlock the secret compartment in the bookshelf, and I was so able to gain access to my studio and ruin my latest work. I, I'm going to punish him for that, but for now, I've changed the combination so they won't be able to get his hands on the key again. But first, I must make a note of the combination before I forget. Who is he, this Hugo that Uncle was writing about? He's the guy that's trapped in the basement, dude. So, those are barred up. Something about a secret compartment in the bookcase. I should take a closer look. Yes, you should. Iliad. Oh. Don Quixote. Famous painters. It's a code. You. Do you remember that note? I do remember that note. Plus, I think it's sitting right here. After dusk and before dawn, portrait painter of his life history. Room four. Row one, book four. All right. Keep clipping, clicking off of the game. All right. So row one, that's that. So we need to find after dusk, before dawn. Befriending a squirrel. If she gets out, I'm gonna. Before boost dusk her. and after dawn. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Yay! I want a secret compartment like that that you gotta get the books. He's scary. I don't want There is a key out. in the drawer. Well, that's good. There's a key to the There's studio. nothing else in the drawer. That's probably one of the rooms upstairs. If they have the. Oh. Yeah, had to have me go this way, didn't you? All right, well, let's see. I'm not going back in there. Oh, you coward. I wouldn't go back in there either. There's no doorknob here. There's a red piece of cloth on it. Even more books. Encyclopedia of the Human Body Parts from A to Z. That ain't creepy. How to Cope with Murder? Fantastic Tales of... I don't even know how to say that. Just a fictional novel. Encyclopedia of Woodworks. <laughs> Despite the size, this deck of bust is pretty heavy. I know what I'm doing with that. <laughs> Crushing Game of Chairs. Skull? Remember yeah. these now. I remember these novels. Eight books, a thousand pages each, and it's not finished yet. Jeez. Oh, that's a Game of Thrones reference. Pressing the switch does nothing. It must be broken. Some books. Computers for not so young people. Do not fear the mouse. It's not a real rodent. No. 
bills. Just a bunch of bills. Old typewriter. Uh, nope, they are definitely moving by themselves. Are you sure? Good, good, good. Definitely want that letter opener. I know what I'm doing with that. No bars are installed from the window. When did they become so paranoid? No, I think they're preparing to keep you in. It's locked. It's locked. Crap. All right. Oh, there are, uh... Brute force always does the trick. Yes, it does. Key. There's a key inside the box. Not for long. Well, screw you. There's a locked stuff. There's a locked stuff. On the other side. I'm glad I didn't just find my aunt. Oh, I know. Just won't open. Key doesn't fit. Oh my goodness, if she's in here, I'd scream like a little girl. <laughs> and which one of us was scared by this game? Alright. Face brush, hmm, I might not I might be able to use it somewhere. Alright. If she's right outside the door. No comment on bars on your door? Your bed? I'm assuming that just about everything in here has some sort of importance. Um, you could try the glue and the brush on that piece that's down. Like this? Yeah. I suppose we could. We'll just make a mess. Yes, yes, she will. Did you find something for the key? That was in the. Uh... There are two buttons left. Well, let me pick them up. You want to probably go back into that study area? No, I want to burn it. Alright, so let's go right. That wasn't good. The hell? <laughs> this can't be real. Yeah, this can't be real. I don't think it can see me. But I better try to make no noise at all. I believe it can hear me. I believe it can hear just fine. Everything in this room makes noise. <laughs> Makeup will not improve its looks. I don't know what to do with that. Can you walk out? I can walk out, but I don't know where to go from here. Following you. Wires are exposed here. So. Hmm. I wonder if I can go back down and use the sewing kit. Oh, didn't I check the umbrella stand before? No. 29th February 2000. Today is a wonderful day. My little baby boy was born. John said there's something wrong with him and it's because of what we did, but I don't believe him. My little boy is perfect. March 1st, 2000. My little Hugo hasn't eaten anything yet. He refuses to breastfeed. I've been reading my mother's books, and they mention that in some case, that in some cases, children born in this way might be a bit different. 
2nd March 2000. Today I cut myself and Hugo immediately crawled over to lick the blood off the floor. I'm beginning to understand what the books were talking about. But don't worry, my dear. Mommy will take care of all your needs. Oh, I know where this is going. I keep... Is that thing Hugo? Oh, that's most definitely Hugo. Most, most definitely Hugo. There was a drawer or something that was still... It's right locked. In. Okay. Yeah, there's a key here. Small hammer. We can maybe take off. Oh. Screwdriver in the drawer. Yes. There's nothing else in here. Clicking off that game. Mm. Alright, so what do we do with that? Do we take off the uh, board on the door? Take off the board on the door. Oh, and go downstairs. It's a good point. Not that that's going to be a pleasant trip. Keep clicking that doorway. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to burn the lucky socks. Does glue? Uh, what about glue? Does glue burn? Glue doesn't burn. Damn. Mm. Can you pick up the coat? I don't know. Maybe. That might be. Doesn't seem to. Right, let's just go downstairs. Washing machine. Might be useful later. <laughs> I can see something below the washing machine. Don't open that! Something that could work as a lever. No. Oh. Okay, lever. Not this. Me either. Already white and red. See if you can pull some clothes out of your thing or some, uh... God bless it. Oh, you need the planks to lock, nail her. Well, the planks are... in the thing, I mean... I don't know what to do with that. Yeah, but, but... Oh, I do know what to do with that. Never mind. Oh, please tell me that's not... I know what to do with that. What do you mean? Oh, I've got wood. Oh, yes, there is a point. It will burn! Can you pick them up? Oh, turn around. Turn around. Oh, wait, we were going to check the clothes, weren't we? This game is a little hard to navigate. Let's pick up your clothes. Dork. Okay, so that didn't work. Oops. <laughs> Hitting it with a hammer, bad plan. Got it. Um. There are a few blank A4 sheets. I've taken them. To... Oh, that's what I can use to light the fire. Sheets. I'd rather not burn this one. Well, why the hell not? The sheets? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. 
What about the iPad? Can you burn the iPad? Well, the grandma's, or the auntie's gonna be showing up soon. I know. So I found sheets. I don't know how to. You found sheets? Yes. Oh, you know what? I know what to do. Oh. Duh. Typing it. It's okay. typing it out. It's writing on its own. It seems to be some kind of message. Seems to have stopped typing now. So, as if somebody's trying to send me a message. Get the hell out, you idiot. You are in great danger. Dear, my dear nephew, you are in great danger. You need to get out of here as soon as possible. I don't have much time. She is about to find me and continue torturing me. A long time ago, your aunt used a protection glyph in order to stop some unnatural beast from entering our world. You will find this behind the wall. The note ends abruptly. It seems as if something suddenly happened. From, from Okay, so it's behind the wall. Probably one of these places. I don't know why the ant just showed up there that one time. Yes, there is, dang it. Crap. I'm um, thinking she just randomly shows up. I think she does too. I don't know what to do about it. So I don't have fire. And now I'm gonna... She ate me from behind. We knew. Okay, so we kind of cheated and looked up uh, a walkthrough for this game. We were stuck. We were really, we were really very stuck. A um, couple things we learned in doing this. We need to. How do we do that one thing? Well, we need to go in there first, don't we? Yeah, there are certain things this game is still in development, so it's not done yet. So, like, one of the things that we learned was. Oh, I know. We were looking for the glyph behind the wall. Alright, so this is the place that Uncle was talking about in his note. I'll try to remove the wallpaper. Must be the glyph Uncle talked about. I would put that everywhere. Oh, you're supposed to take off the handle. I know. Hold on. Now it's a paintbrush. You don't do that yet. She hasn't to ruin it. Ah, yes. Screwdriver. <laughs> Who would have thought to remove the door handle that easily? Okie dokie! Oh, yes, we're just gonna... <laughs> we're just gonna, like, split, blip, 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 that. <laughs> Felt as if something was guiding my hand. Fate. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Ooh. You just made a really loud noise. Yes. It sounded like you broke a tooth. <laughs> Thank and you that for, is the end. Thank you for playing the Cursed Roots preview. The game is currently under development, and the full version featuring more puzzles, horrors, and mysteries will be out in the coming months. So, this game is not yet done, which no. honestly kind of created a little bit of the problem because we were trying to solve puzzles that haven't been made yet. Yeah, and I think we had the stuff for some of the puzzles. Yeah. Aww, you go smiled. <laughs> Yeah, he's fault. He's a demonic little fetus monster. <laughs> In any case, that is Cursed Roots, the preview. The game should be out 
at some point, um, give it a shot. Mm-hmm. Especially when the full version comes out. And yeah. if you saw something that we didn't, or have any kind of clues for... The, ooh, creepy eyes. Mm-hmm. Or have any kind of clues for things that might be coming, let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching. Good luck. Have fun. Bye-bye.